Today we're going to be looking at this brand new rumor for a LEGO Star Wars Bad Batch set in the winter wave of 2023. Now according to the rumor, this set will be $30, have 254 pieces, and include anywhere from 2 to 4 minifigures. So, what could this set be? For $30, LEGO could give us a variety of sets, but we'll look at the most probable ones. Starting off here, we have the V-Wing. This is a set that would make a lot of sense at this price point. Just a starfighter that played a pretty decent role in the Bad Batch series. Hopefully they make it a little chunkier, make it look a little more detailed like this V-Wing right here. LEGO has been doing a good job detailing these smaller scale ships, so I expect nothing less from them with a V-Wing. Now, uh, this starfighter did play a pretty significant role in the Bad Batch. Every time the Imperials or the clones had to roll out something, the V-Wing was there to do its job, so it would make sense at this price point. This is a cool looking ship, and if it is indeed a V-Wing, I would not be mad. Now, for the minifigures. I expect nothing more than two minifigures for this set, the V-Wing pilot and the astromech droid. I think this would make an all-around pretty cool set. Hopefully we get some new leg and helmet printing on that V-Wing pilot, and a new unique astromech wouldn't hurt as well, but this would be a great $30 set. But if not the V-Wing for $30, I'd really like to see a Riot Racing themed set. I think Riot Racing could be really cool to see in LEGO Star Wars, and it's a set that I see LEGO making for this price point. Now, Riot Racing was when Tech had to take over the speeder thing and beat that race for, you know, his, like, money-dealing woman. I think this could be really cool. Here's a look at a mock of what it would look like in LEGO. I think this set would be amazing. Now, for this set, I'd hope to see a little more than just Tech Speeder. I'd also like to see one or maybe the other two speeders that were most involved with the race and were trying to, like, disable Tech Speeder while they were racing in the fight. Uh, I think this could be a cool set. I don't expect them to make all three. Just Tech Speeder and then one of these two would be really cool. For the minifigures, I'd like to see Tao, the droid that obviously controlled the speeder before Tech had to take over. I think this could be cool to see in LEGO, and I'm interested to see how LEGO would make a mold for his unique body. Next, I'd like to see this guy right here, Grinny Krellen, I think his name is. He's pretty cool, big guy. I would like to see him in LEGO too because he played a pretty prominent role and it'd be a cool minifigure to have. Next, I'd like to see Kane, one of the drivers that was trying to take out Tech. And along with Kane, I would like to see this guy right here. I forget his name, but he needs to be in the set as well. And then obviously, a Tech minifigure to wrap up this set. But not all of these minifigures, just three or four of them would be perfect for the set. But all in all, this rumor is very, very exciting. A Bad Batch set is always a cool set to have. And for $30, this is a set that everyone can get. So I'm excited to see what LEGO does, whether it's one of the two I suggested or maybe another one.